Hey everyone, it's Comp Help, and today I'm going to show you how to do pop-up boxes and how to, well, do this. Let me show you. Okay, where is my document? Okay, you're going to make a VBS file and pretty much make that, okay? And see how it just did like a couple messages? I'm going to show you how to do that, okay? So let me show you that right now, and uh, yeah. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and right click your desktop and go to new and go to text document okay notepad this doesn't matter because this is just your sort of template or I don't know this your rough draft I can say open that and what you want to type is this okay and make sure you get this right I know I'm gonna have at least one person come up to me and say okay I didn't get this right what did I do wrong I will post this in the description and you can change all the stuff you want on it I don't care I'll post this, you know, little code, whatever you call it, in the description. So anyway, type it exactly like I do. X space equals message box, MSG box, parentheses, quotation, and this right here is going to be what's inside of the box. Not the title, but the words. So I'm going to say something like, um, hey, what's cracking? And then quotation to end that sentence, okay? Press comma I'm just gonna do 4 plus 16 now this is a combination of uh, symbols actually the first one I don't know I'm not sure what is what but one of them is the symbol such as the red X that you probably saw in my last pop-up that I showed you and the other number is the yes or no option to press to continue yada yada okay, I'll, I'll explain that in a bit Next you want to do is space, quotation, and this is going to be the title of the box. So I'm going to name it Annoying Box. Okay? And quotation and parentheses. Just like that. That's that's the code. Not hard. You can type this in seconds. Click File, Save As, and this right here is the most important part. Name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it Prank.VBS. That is the key to really making this whole pop-up box thing. Not sure what VBS stands for. Someone post it in the comments if you know what it is. Um, but that's just what it is. That's the command. Okay. And you click save. All right. Right away, you'll see this right here, the VBS file pop up. Now you could delete this. Well, actually, yeah, you could delete that. Let's double click the prank file and boom. Annoying box and hey, what's cracking? Now the four plus sixteen. I don't know which one, but the four could have been this red X, or the four could have been yes or the no buttons and the no buttons, or the sixteen could have been this. I'm, I'm not sure, but it's a combination of stuff. Um, you can search on Google all the different codes. So let's click yes or no. It doesn't really matter. And boom, you are out of it. Now let's say you want to continue this and annoy the heck out of your friend. Go to open with right click the VBS file and open it with notepad. Next, just copy that by highlighting it and hold CTRL and press C for copy. That's the copy command. Uh, press enter to go to the next line and hold CTRL and press V. There you go, that's the paste um, command for oh, Windows. Okay, anyway, so now I can change this right here. Hey, what's cracking? Um, I wonder if you pressed yes. And then uh, let's go to the next line and go to that and say, did you press no this time? Okay, and then we'll just go to file and save it. Now you just made your longer pop-up box. Now if you want to, wanted to really, really just annoy your friend like crazy, all you do is you right-click, copy, and paste, 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 you know, and do that, but yeah. I'm not going to do that because I'm about to show you what I just did. Okay, so then you go to File, Save, and uh, you double click it. And hey, what's cracking? I wonder if you pressed yes. Did you press no this time? It doesn't matter whether you pressed yes or no, it's going to go to the next box, okay? So that's basically how you make the prank box, I mean the prank pop up box, um, to disguise this icon. You can easily make a new shortcut directed to this file and uh, change the icon of the shortcut. You cannot change the icon of this, though. 
Okay, so thank you everyone for watching this video. Please rate, comment, subscribe, respond to this video with all your different pop-up boxes you did, all the pranks that you pulled off on your friends. I don't care, just please subscribe to me, um, support me, yada yada. Goodbye, thanks for watching.